Hey, how you doing? We're gonna be looking at some lovely buttons using a bit of code pen code. I've got over here a section, nothing fancy going on, but I wanna add a button with a bit of movement. Why? Because it can sometimes make a bit of a difference on your website. Just add a little bit of creativity. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna drop in the HTML widget. Literally, that is it. We just drop it in and then a bit of code. The description, well, copy of the code will be in the description so you can go away and have a look at it. Let's stick that in. We now have a wavy, liquidy, watery kind of movement going on there with the word button. Over here, I have added in how you would add in a link. So what you would do is you would modify this bit to say whatever you wanna say. Let's put it back to button. And then you would put in your hyperlink. Now the hyperlink could be to a page, a section, a menu anchor, whatever you want, okay? So you can do exactly kind of what you're doing with a button. Um, if you wanna use this to summon a pop-up, you got to create your pop-up, go over to um, where you assign your pop-up to a button, hover over it, and then a code will appear, okay? Or you can inspect it, get that code, and again, you can assign it over here as well. But the key bit is that you can start to modify, oh, 20, you can start to modify the size of it, the, the font family, the padding, the border radius. Look, if I take this off, it's gonna have nothing in. Let's put 40 back in. But there are loads of things here you can do, play around, mess around with how it looks. But if I just scroll down, if I put this over to be, I think if I go for 00FF, we have a blue pattern. Down here, we have somewhere, let me just get it, we have 45% border radius, which you might think, well, what the heck's that all about? Watch what happens when I change this to be 5%. It's a bit more of a crazier, wavier pattern going on there. So there's a few things you can do. Play around with each of these, um, you know, settings. But the great thing is, is you now have a button that you can stick in your header, your footer, anywhere on your page, and it just looks great. And it just adds a little bit of a unique feel to your website. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow, and I will see you soon.